If you don't know about Deco buying our Rubai, check out the. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the playoffs. It's Reading against Nottingham Forest. The floodlights beaming down from the night sky. So without further ado, we take you to Reading. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Simon Cox, pass it to Nick Blackman, goes into the penalty area, skips past defenders, and that's a great goal by Nick Blackman. 1-0 against Nottingham Forest, but remember guys, we won 5-0 against Nottingham Forest in the first leg of this playoff game semi-final. So, surely, 6-0 on aggregate, we are on our way to the final. Booming, booming, boom, boom, boom. Nottingham Forest, the player skips past the defenders, all across the face of goal, oh, so close. Federici had to be aware there. Add up the scores, and you can see who is heading towards the final, unless they blow it, I can't see them blowing it from this, Alan. Oliver Norwood is on the ball right now, a nice little turn to lay it off to Cox, he turns round, oh, that's a great save by their keeper. Keep it at 1-0. And Coxie is on the ball. He turns. Oh my god, it's... Oh, that's a good save from their keeper. It was curling and swerving, but the keeper had to keep it out. Oh, uh, can we punish him from this corner? Header. Oh, rebound, come on. Oh dear. Whee, way over. And I think the former Reading player, Antonio... Oh, he gets away. Oh, that's a goal-saving block there. Fleming, hell, that was a great block. But they have a corner. Could be dangerous. Coming in. Federici makes a good punch away. Oh, there's another good block. And they get another corner. Oh, we can't get it away. Coming in. And yet again, Federici is there. The Australian beast. Can we uh, forge a counter-attack? Come on, get past the defender. The defender, no, he's doing his duties fine. That's fair play to the lad. That's the former Reading player again, Antonio, who could hurt his former club. Oh, Federici makes a good save, and the defender was well placed in case it went uh, past Federici. Here's Nick Blackman. Oh, two defenders against one person. Who's going to win? You think it's going to be the two per people? They off to Mackie, and that's a great finish. Nick Blackman stormed past two defenders. Wow, awful defending. It's 2-0, 7-0 on aggregate. And we are heading to the playoff final, guys. It's not quite automatic promotion, but it's almost that. And look at that great turn. Lays it off to Mackie, and it's a good left foot finish. Not sure what his preferred foot is, but, no, any, but you know, that was still a good finish. Nottingham Forest storm into the penalty box. That's a bad challenge and a penalty to Nottingham Forest. Oh, what's going to happen to him? Oh, no. Oh, only a yellow for Akiempa or Hector, I don't know. Come on. Come on, save it, Federici. No, he went the wrong way. Federici went left. And Patterson went right. And it's 2-1, but on aggregate, on aggregate it is 7-1. So that won't dent our um, playoff final hopes. It won't dent them at all. So it's been a good game, apart from that challenge, obviously. We all with control. Brilliant save. Wow, top class there. We're coming the play down now. It's a cross in. Oh, and he gets head on it, and it's a great goal by Simon Cox. It was a 3-1 or 8-1 um, lead over Nottingham Forest in the build-up to the playoff final. That was a great cross. I thought we were calming the play down, you know, slowing it down, being defensive. But no, great cross in from a beater or, one, or somebody, and a great header, and goalkeeper had no chance. From the back, because it's a back pass to the keeper. The game is over here. The final whistle has gone, and the final scoreline is 3-1. Well, that's the end of this.
drawn out semi-final over the two legs and they are through they've made it to the final on aggregate well they can start celebrating now they've put in a Welcome to EA Sport live coverage of the playoffs. It's Wigan Athletic against Reading. Let's get straight to Wembley then now. Not North London's best day. At the moment, the rain is lashing down. Here's your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. What a long season it's been for these two teams. Uh, they failed to get up by the conventional route. They've had to come through the playoffs, but here they are in the final with a chance. It's uh, Death or glory, isn't it, for one or the other? Well, it is, I think, so often. It's not always the best team that wins these kind of matches, but it's the team that can handle the pressure, that can produce, you know, under an awful amount of tension. It's been a good start from Reading, if I may say so. Is that a free kick? No, great shot and a good save. Al Habsi's reaction had to be pinpoint perfect there, as you will clearly see from this replay. We have a corner. Can we lead in this game? That was a close header, but we can't get the lead in this playoff final versus Wigan on a dreary day. Pong with the shot, and that's another good save from Al Habti. And they somehow, somehow clear it away. And Drenthe moving around nicely there. Takes the left foot shot. Oh, it strikes the posts. How close. Interception and clear the ball away. Drenta. Got to be. That defending team really defending for all they're worth. They've got a corner now. The pacey beast with a header. Oh, and right, now Hobbsy managed to tip it over for yet another corner. Come on. Swung in. Oh, almost, almost. Can we get it back in the box? No, no. Okay. Stop Salgado. Great bit of defending, and that's about half time now. Told you. Let's see what the second half brings. And we haven't yet got a goal to bring to you. Nil nil at half time. Half time, teams level, just as expected, Alan. Yeah, it's been a good first half, and we've had a few chances, but uh, I don't know. I think in the second half, we might see a little bit more of an open game. and even more chances. Trenty with the pass from Robson Carnu, and he's away. Shrugs the defender off, and it slides under Al Habsi to make it 1 0 to Reading in the playoff final. The playoff final here. 1 0. Just straight after half time, people coming back getting their food will probably throw the food up in the air in excitement because it is 1 0 to Reading. Deservedly, I might add. running it was the pace of the passing and the control as well it was it was all spot on into the attacking third and that's not a really good tackle from Pierce oh and McCarthy had to be at the top of his game there great save terrific tackle I think New has been a bit quiet but that's a great pass Robson Carter and it trickles into the goal Robson Carter with a brace 2-0 to Reading in this playoff final game against Wigan. I think Wigan have virtually given up now. It's double delight for this player. He's beaten the goalkeeper twice now. And it's 2-0 here. Grant Holt. Come on, stop it. Great save by McCarthy. What was that? A bad tackle. That was. It's a penalty. It could be a decisive moment because they could get back in the game, Wigan. They look like they've given up, but this could give them a, a lifeline. He tries to chip it! McCarthy has managed to save the penalty from going in and the Wigan now have probably given up. That was a cheeky little dink, but McCarthy wasn't having any of it. That's a very crisp challenge there. Gente finds some space, shoots from long range. Oh, he was almost full there. Can we get come on back back in, back in, back in? Oh, we can't win the header. Oh, and the chance is gone now. Espinosa with a left-footed corner. It swung in. Oh, that's not too far away. They could have. Had, that was a good chance for them there. That's a 
that's a fantastic achievement they've got there by the playoff route they've won this uh, shootout for promotion uh, an excellent effort brilliant oh, be get in there we've beaten Wigan by a comprehensive two goals to nil Yeah, they've always stuck together in this competition and they did over the course of that 90 minutes we've just seen. That team spirit has taken them a long way, hasn't it? Well, there's an old expression being up for the cup. This team have certainly been up for this challenge and they're going to lift up the cup very shortly. English Football League Championship final Wigan Athletic nil Reading two however it's not David Nugent who won the golden boot this year it's um Wigan's Diego Suarez I don't know how many goals but he obviously got more than David Nugent but I'm sure David Nugent was in the top three well he we could have been top two and it says Reading secure promotion with clinched promotion in the Barclays Premier League season and it's full of drama you mean the championship season obviously and that was a great victory for Reading there I'm going to save anything before <laughs> in case anything goes wrong it's been great fun doing this series with you the great YouTube community thanks for watching guys and see you soon